Frank Coughlin. I'm the mayor of Plymouth Borough. I'm here this afternoon to honor John on the occasion of his 100th birthday. Congratulations, John, and many more to come. World War II watch, keep time. Oh, thank you. Oh, you're welcome. I was in the Mays Hall after, after, after supper. There must have been about, maybe about 20 fellows. The mess Hall blew up. I was the only one that came out. You heard screaming, nothing. Then you heard silence. Then you're sliding, going back and forth, saying prayers and saying things. You never said in your life, but you said in there. Water, your oil was coming in. You couldn't see. Then I seen a little crack by a door. Uh, it was a hatch. It was warped. Oh my gosh. That's sight to heaven. And I pushed with my shoulder. I cut and bled. And I yelled and pushed. So and I went and I scraped through. I said, and it was right into a big, huge cargo hole. And the cargo net was nearby. So I managed to go to the cargo head. Climbed over my cargo head. Went aboard the ship, side of the ship. And looked on the side of the ship. There was a place to town. Didn't see anybody. So I crawled up and crawled up. Around, around and uh, then I heard the voice. And says, hey, hey, Mac. Where have you been? Where the hell are you going? I look and I swear I didn't see anybody. I looked and I looked and looked. I said, see, imagination's getting the best of me. I said, you heard me, damn it. Where are you going? And I said, oh, I said, they need help in the mess hall. God doesn't help them. They're all gone. Get the hell off the ship. I just went to the water. Seen an empty life jacket and a hand on the life jacket. And it went on to a, a box, a box rack. It was like it's always hanging on. He sat on a box rack. So one of these, one of these ranging boards were picking up and picked this up and took this one over to the dock and over to the side. And that was treated on the, on the beach.